Hi everyone, it's Alan here once again. Yeah. It's been an absolute um, mess today. Um, constant rain. I did go out, but uh, it got to a point... Well, it uh, was pretty bad. All it's done is rain on, off, on, off, on, off. And, yeah. Well... Alfie's been in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. And George has been sat in the other room. And, uh, yeah. Just waiting for him, just waiting for Alfie to come back. Uh, he's not really our cat. <laughs> he's not our cat. He's number 20, 29 is down the bottom. Uh, but... Uh, as I said in my last video they've got another cat and uh, yeah things basically changed here so we've got two cats here <laughs> so hopingly very soon uh, Alfie will go home f uh, for some you know sometime I'm just waiting for him to turn up um he's been up in and out in and out in and out all night it's like he's been on he's really unsettled um so I'm just waiting to see what happens uh yeah we've been having lots of fireworks going off as well uh he's probably cowering some place um I just thought uh, is okay I'm just waiting for him to come back um, yeah but uh, you know you can't be nasty about these things you know if a cat chooses if a cat chooses to come and live with you you know don't forget cats don't you know cats pick you, pick you you know that's the way it goes, if you like it or not. And if a cat imprints on you, oh, you know, it's just one of those things that happens. So, yeah. Well, we had the budget today. Um, one of the things you could have done is uh, increase... Uh, cigarettes so you know it would have been better if he had done and uh, yeah it's just one of those things that uh, happens um, yeah take a walk on the wild side did a video today um, about people in Blackpool what it is uh, people don't want to pay for the PC, uh, electoral flow test and they're saying that the electoral flow tests are still pricey and when you do travel on holiday the rumour is that there are only certain testing companies that they're approving of and it's really a bit of a mess because these companies can charge up to £217 just for a test um yeah that's a lot of money also um yeah when Stephen 
walked around by the pole. It caused the issue of the number of building projects that was, you know, building new houses and everything. They'd basically stopped because the companies had gone bust. And there was a Bingo 3000. I think it was Bingo 3000. Um, they were going to build a club there. The upper part and upper part of the shell and the brick part was all put up. But it's not finished. It's not finished at all. So, yeah, unfinished project. So they're going to have to basically do something with that. Um, there are projects all over Blackpool. There are all over the place. Some have been completed. Some have been completed. Really, what needs to happen is all the is an effort to get these projects finished and uh, get them all done because a lot of Blackpool I'm sorry to say this but I'm gonna have to it's Chavland honestly it's Chavland um, and it's not as if you know, that there aren't any jobs. It's because the people that are just too lazy um, to, you know, buy for them. So what generally happens is outsiders come in and they take the jobs and basically a lot of people in a lot of people uh, in the Blackpool area, and uh, you know, won't take them. But at the end of the day, you've got to look at it this way: a job's a job, and very soon, um, you see, they're gonna they're gonna cut the amount of you see that you get to make that to make people. Um, well, to make people go and find work, but uh, these people who can't be bothered to get off their backside, um, you know, um, you know, there should be more things done about that. Um, in some cases, maybe take the money off them and say, right, go and find it. Go and find, uh, go and find work, and uh, yeah, because a lot of, lot of other countries you don't get this form of social, of uh, social safety net. You have to pay into it, and you have to pay. Like, take you say if you were in Spain, right? If you're in Spain, you have to pay in. Uh, you have to have private health care insurance, you know. Um, it's completely, totally different there. Um, yeah. And it can get rather messy. Uh, if, you haven't got, if you haven't got comprehensive health care insurance or you pay into the Spanish uh, social security system because they do have a social security system with which you have to contribute to. It's like ours, but you have to pay pay in for the lifetime of, of uh, when you work. And uh, that's how you uh, get your benefit sort of thing if you are made unemployed um, but you only get what you pay in you don't get anything more than that 
that's all you get. Yeah, it is quite windy tonight, and I've got GB news on, and uh, I'm just waiting to see what happens now. I'm waiting to see if, if Alfie comes back. And I just hope he doesn't bring anything back with him, you know. Oh, my God. I remember Sot. Sot used to uh, go out. He used to, he used to have... He used to bring back mice. And uh, go into the corner of the room and, you know, <coughs> have a... Pl have a have a pl have a plan before I know. I mean, I mean this crunch, 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 crunch noise. What the hell? The book of all the words and did he eat it? Yeah. This is one of the things we have to be careful of, you know. Just in case they bring, bring anything in, you know. Um. Yeah. It's mainly, it's mainly in this area. It's mainly baby rats. Uh, this is the reason why I'm back here. we have to be more careful around here than anything else. You want baby rats in your house. Um, cause if they get in, they'll probably hide somewhere and they'll dig somewhere and before you know it, you've got a flipping rat's nest underneath, underneath your floor and that. It's not good. Um, the houses at Griffin, the new ones, um, at back of the, they have, back at church, they've all gone up, well, some have gone up, and they're just finishing, finishing that off. It makes the area, to be truthful, it makes the area look a bit odd. Because you've got these new houses there, and then you've got directly across the road uh, a row of rows and rows and rows of terraced houses. You know, I don't know why they couldn't have uh, done a version of that. As these, some of these are detached and semi-detached houses. Um, there, so we'll just have to see how things go. Um, area Mill Hill. I understand. Queen with bottom end of Forest Street. Um, they've they've got um houses all the way up to the back as far as the. It's not right onto the back. Yeah, it is. It's right onto the back of the where the railway line is. But they put like a footpath a bit going behind the estate. I don't know if there is a accessible um, part to that. I don't know if they've built a new plat platform there for uh, people to get on and off the train. Because if I remember too rightly, there's a staircase there and you cannot get a wheelchair up there. You just can't. It's basically impossible. And uh, I'm going to have to go down there sooner or later and get some, get some footage of that. And uh, I, might e I might even... Uh, you know, get the camera out and look through the estate and see if I can get up to the railway, up to the uh, railway station that way, and uh, see if the um, modifications have been done. For all I know, they might have put a platform on the other side. You know, take one side. You know. Um, make it a double sided platform you know one on one side one on the other because the way that they've done it you know there's only enough room for one platform either side the way they've done it so we'll just have to wait and see when I go up there, go up there to, um, and take some footage of, of the of it. 
did do um, a video on Malel, but I, I think I lost it some. I think I lost it. Um, because I was supposed to have put it up, but uh, it didn't come out too well because the phone kept overheating. So we'll do a bit of a of a shoot of what of what that looks like now, because there's quite a lot of uh, areas in Blackburn that have had stuff done. Um, there are even talks of putting. Uh, more houses up there on some of the derelict land um, Saint Pete, what used to be Saint, where St Peter's School used to be, the old one is now a um, estate they completely done all that and it's all done I'm quite surprised they don't take all those when you go down the slope where the playgrounds used to be at the side. I don't know if that's still there or not. But uh, at the bottom when you get to get to Queen Victoria Street at the end there's a grassy a a area with trees. That used to have a cabin on it. When Saint Peter's had it, when Saint Peter's had the school at the top there, and there used to be an old piano in there. I'll be looking this one off at night. It's up you to you. To it. It's up to you. you can take. Will, will it need battery charging up more? Yeah, it will do. So I'll leave it on and just hope for it best and charge it up in the morning. Just, uh, just turn it off, but or unless. Un unless uh, you want to keep it, unless you want to keep it on. No, I don't think anybody's phoning me up, do you? I, well, this at this time at night, I don't think so. But mm -hmm. you never know. Mm -hmm. But uh, well, I'll see you the bottom button in it. Yeah, it's the bottom button. Mm -hmm. Should do anyway. It should come up. It should. It should come. Uh, it's it right sh to open. That's all. Yeah, it should. It's, when you press on it, it should uh, it sh it it's should gone off. it's gone off, mm -hmm. uh, but it hasn't switched off. That's just gone into standby mode. All right, then. Is that it's that, well, saving your battery. Saving, it's saving your battery because you turn your screen off. No sign of him. No sign of him yet. No window open. Windows open, yeah. But it's a hell of a long way to climb up. Mm -hmm. You know to jump up. I know, but so remember when Sot used to do it. Yeah, but somebody damaged it. Yeah, I think, I've, yeah, I yeah. Oh well, that was my mum. Yeah, she's just got a new uh, Samsung A12. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to have to get a memory card for that and uh, put a memory card in it so she can take pictures and everything. Yeah, it's uh, not a good night really. Uh, Alf has been out for quite some time. He might have even gone home even. He might have paid home a little visit and, uh, you know... Hey Google, what's the time? It's 10.34 p.m. 10.34 p.m. Um, yeah. We're going to have to do something about Alfie, really, because uh, he, he doesn't really bel he doesn't belong to us. Um, he, shall we say, he's just a guest here at the moment. Um, yeah, so things, things will ought to, we ought to get them sorted out by and by the end of this week. It's now third, it's now Wednesday, coming up to Thursday, 
and uh, this is the second week of Alfie's visit and uh, we'll just have to wait and see what happens uh, he's going to have to go home sooner or later even though that they've introduced even though they've got a new cat there and uh, but uh, we'll see how it goes so I'm going to bugger off now and I'm going to go and get some I don't know. I'm, I've, I've got oh, since since I was out today. I've I've had nothing but hunger pangs today, you know. Um, I did go out, but I didn't shoot any of it. Yeah, I've had nothing but hunger pangs today, so we'll just have to see what happens. Well, I'm going to bugger off now, and uh, see how things go. So. It's bye for now. Three, two, one, click.